Baltimore Orioles hosting the Tampa Bay Rays, and the Rays are minus 145 on the money line. The Orioles are plus 125. The over-under is eight and a half runs. Tampa laying a run and a half is plus 120, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by two. And Baltimore getting a run and a half are minus 140, meaning if you bet them that way and they win the game outright, you win. If they lose the game by one, you win. Now, Springs has pitched twice against the Orioles this year. They were both in relief. He went one inning, no runs, no earned. They won two to one. And a third of an inning, no runs, no earned. They won that game 8-0. Bradish is a rookie. He hasn't pitched against the Rays. The Rays are on a one-game losing streak. The Orioles are on a two-game winning streak. And they finally beat the Rays. It's the first time in like 13 games that they've done so. Head-to-head, -head, Tampa's 9-1 against Baltimore. The team laying a run and a half is 7-3. The under, whatever the casino has set it at, is 5-4-1. and one. However, the over, 8.5, is 6-4. Shockingly enough, I'm going to take Tampa with the money line, Tampa laying the runs and the over. Eventually, a blind squirrel finds a nut. I think that that was the Orioles game last night, so I don't think they're going to win back to back. I could be entirely wrong. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if I'm wrong.